On today's episode of In The Know, we'll be exploring exciting updates to QuickBooks Bill Pay. Now, you and your clients can request personalized processing limits. Hey, Bro Advisors, it's Jacqueline, and you're watching In The Know, where you get exclusive access to demos of Intuit product enhancements by the leaders who built them. Let's jump right in with Jorge and James. Jorge, James, welcome. Hi, Jacqueline. Thank you for inviting us. Thanks for having us. We are really excited to talk with you today. We have some great information we want to share with, with all the accountants that are viewing this um, tied to bill pay and limits. What I'm going to do is going to share a few slides, if that's okay, and then we could talk about what the experience is. So QuickBooks Bill Pay is a full end-to-end -end AP solution in QuickBooks that is available to you and your clients to help streamline your AP process. It's built right into QuickBooks so everything works seamlessly and it helps you to do everything from leveraging automation tools and our AI to import bills, to managing your vendors, inviting them to provide the payment information, to scheduling your bills for payment, and getting cash flow insights. Bill Pay offers three tiers today, basic, premium, and elite. So that allows you to select the tier and features and controls that you need to meet your client's needs. Our basic is $0 per month, so it enables you to have a trial of the product and you get five free ACH. But if you have more intense needs, meaning a client with more bills to pay, or perhaps they have contractors they work with, you get premium with 40 free ACH and unlimited 1099 filing. And for those clients that are larger, you may need more enhanced workflows to control who can view what and do what in QuickBooks. And for that, we have Bill Pay Elite. What I'd love to highlight here is some of the changes we made to our product. One, you can schedule payments faster now, so same day payment scheduling. Two, if you're paying through checks, you can now view voided checks, and you can also view endorsed checks. So once you pay your client with a check, if they, if your vendor comes back and says, hey, I don't think you paid the check, you actually have a vision you can share with them. But what I'm excited to share with you today is really more limits. So with Bill Pay, we've heard the voice of our accountants highlighting that their clients want more visibility into their bill pay limits. They found daily limits restrictive, which impacted the way they're working with their clients and their ability to pay bills. We've heard this loud and clear and we've addressed it. We wrote out a new limit policy that should help ensure that your clients have the best limit they can get. One, two, we removed daily limits. So that shouldn't be an issue. And three, um, we enabled the ability in product to request personalized limits. Um, either whether you experience a limit decline or proactively when you want to go in there and adjust. So I have James here, who I'm excited to have him share the demo around how limits works. Great. Thanks, Jorge. We're really excited to demo this capability for you today. The experience starts on your QBOA homepage. You can drill down to whichever client you'd like to make a bill pay limit request for. And you can navigate to the gear icon in the top right corner and select the account and settings option. On the left side, you have all these different options. You can select expenses. And then there's a new section of the page called bill pay. And you have this processing limit row where you can select request new limit. We recommend you add a value here that is the sum total of all bills you need to pay in the next 30 days. And maybe go a little bit higher than that just so you have some buffer. Then you can go ahead and click continue. And here we have a confirmation page just showing the value that you're requesting. You can click send request. Currently, all bill pay limit increase requests will result in a two day business review. Um, we're looking for ways to speed this up, but you can go ahead and select done. And then once you submit this request, your client, whoever, whomever from your client receives emails today will receive this confirmation email just confirming that we received your request. And then two days later, hopefully sooner, you'll receive this confirmation email confirming your new limit. One question we've heard from accountants is, how do I know what my current limit is? If you request a limit value that's beneath your current limit, we'll let you know on screen and you can go ahead with continuing to process. Uh, for your needs. 
This is just the beginning and we're looking forward to improving this experience even more for you in the future. Awesome. Jacqueline, I'm so excited that we had the opportunity to share this with you and our fellow accountants here, largely because processing limits is something that shouldn't be a barrier to kind of paying your bills, right? Bill pay has one job and that's to pay, help you pay your bills. And now you can do that with the confidence that you have the right amount you need to cover your needs of yourself and your clients. And that's what makes it really exciting. And in, in case the situation arises where you do run into a limit issue, any admin can go and request a limit. And so you'll see the, the, the payment was declined, request a new limit, and you're able to make those adjustments. And as James mentioned, we're going to look to kind of make this better each day. So our return time and approval time will be even faster. James, Jorge, thank you so much. And thank you for watching. If you find this update interesting or helpful, go ahead and like, comment, and subscribe. Let me recap with the fast facts. Personalized processing limits is available to customers and their accountants marked as admins and is live in the US as of April. That's all we have for now. For more product updates and demos, check out our In The Know Hub. We'll catch you next time.